Hello everyone, welcome to another True Peace video and in this video I'm gonna go ahead and talk about the heavy weapon skills. Now for those who are weapon, like heavy weapon skill, you no, heavy weapon users, this video is for you. Now for those who do not know the heavy weapons, pretty much they're the, this weapon here. Now they're just heavy weapons. Now this is my uh, this is my best heavy weapon in the game, pretty much. So, it's called the... It's called the... Let me see. It's called the Fine Great Sword, and it gives me 210 strength. And it also says here what type of weapon it is, which is the heavy weapon. So, let's go ahead and equip that. And, of course, equip the skills that we need to use the, to use it. You know, the skills we need for the heavy weapons now the first skill is gonna be the berserk smash so what this does is you just slam the ground with your weapon damaging enemies in the radius so whoever's around you will get damage and also it costs 60,000 belly and 60 milli weapon mastery to be able to unlock this okay the next one is the savage blitz now what it does is you just swing your weapon multiple times stunning and damaging enemies that are around you and the requirements for this is 100 milli weapon mastery and 90,000 belly now next one is the berserk dive now what this does is you just jump at the air and then dive to the closest enemy that you find and damage them now the requirements for this is 160 milli weapon mastery and 140,000 belly the last and final skill is going to be the Berserk Charge. Now, what this does is you just go straight forward towards your enemy and then just damage them. So, the requirements for this is 240 melee weapons mastery and 220,000 belly. Now, once again, I'm just going to say for you to be able to use the skills, you'll need a heavy weapon equipped. Now, if you don't have any heavy weapon equipped, this skills will not be usable at all so right now i have a heavy weapon equipped and we're gonna go ahead and show you what it looks like so the first one is gonna be this one here so if you do if you do remember it it's called the berserk smash so what we do is we just smash the ground and hopefully we'll be able to get a kill so let's go towards the opponent that we're supposed to go to and we find our opponent right over here now we're gonna co click one and you just pretty much just did what i have whatever i just did right now so let me just oh my god that move was so useless it did not deal any okay there you go so that was the sma the berserk smash pretty useful I if I say so myself because you just de dealt a huge damage and it stuns them kind of so let's go to the next one which is the savage blizz now this one we used this one and it was kind of useless at first so let's go ahead and use it click to and as you can see here that's how much it is useless so it does not give you an easy way out it just gives you the hardest way out as possible it only damaged like once or twice and you're just hoping that you at least get the luck to be able to hit your enemy with your savage blitz or whatever so i would say savage blitz not recommended i would not get this myself because it's totally useless and you're just hoping for luck here now let's go to the next one which is going to be the berserk dive so what i would do right now is just go way farther away from this gunslinger click three and then you just did that so it is pretty cool pretty nice i would be this is a good combo for the smash room the smash dive thingy which is nice okay so you know what i would say it's pretty good i like the berserk dive much more better than the savage blitz now let's go to the next one which is the berserk charge so pretty much you just charge towards your opponent so hopefully this is not that complicated so let's go click four and boom that is pretty nice i like that i actually do like that so there you go um we did that and you just straightforward go to your opponents it deals uh damage towards them and 
I would say the most useful thing you can actually get yourself in the with the with the great sword or what's it called again heavy weapon skills so that is the most useful skill in the heavy weapons i if i say so myself i'm saying it okay so let's go ahead and of course use it one last time click four and boom as you can see there we just did that towards that guy but yes that would be it for this video i am done talking about the heavy weapon and i'm also done talking about the skills itself so yes if you have any questions i would love to answer them any question is available to ask and hopefully i'll be able to answer you in the comments so yes that would be it for this video